it's rough at home and we're worried about the people we love, what do we do to get through bad patches? We be spontaneous. We do the things that make us laugh. We have fun. <laughs> Nadira is meeting her wedding planner today. Why don't you come along? I think she could use some girl time. As long as Bobby thinks his family is falling apart, he'll be happy to be as far away from this dysfunctional rabble as possible. It's all going exactly as we planned, Dad. You're working with Silas. Silas doesn't love you. You know that, right? No matter how much you act like the nice guy, deep down you'll always be in Brody's shadow. It's about who killed Brody. Do you know who did it? It was Damon. You really can't come to this party. Joseph's gonna be here, and I, I think he's bringing his friends, and they'll be looking to kick off. I'm not gonna let him chase me away. Demarcus is carrying a knife. He thinks he's carrying it for protection, but I just know it never ends well. Tell Saul to leave Demarcus out of here. We don't need no police help. Just as well, that's a good fit for you, James Nightingale. I have a feeling you're going to be in there for quite a while. I'm gonna make your life hell. You're an inspiring woman, Miss Palmalek. Being around you makes me feel like I'm more capable. I'm ready to face anything. I'm here for you. I'm ready to get up there to tell all those people exactly what that man did to me. You targeted those girls. What you did was cruel and disrespectful. I'm an alcoholic. And when I needed you most, you turned your back on me. We think that Wendy's taking Bobby to Silas. Silas what? So, you remember the rules? Yes, get inside, steal my passport, get out. Less than five minutes. Ah, you're forgetting the most important rule? Oh. Don't be seen by anyone. Yes, like James Bond, British superstar. Bobby! Destinations change, love. And you are in for a treat. <laughs> what? It's Wendy Blissey. She's been involved in a road traffic accident. I'm sorry to inform you she didn't make it. She's dead. I'm not an angel, remember? I am the one that killed Brody. It was Warren, okay? Warren killed Brody. This obsession that you and Warren have got with each other is toxic. The hunter ran over to the window. Okay. Took a good aim. And that was the this? end of the wolf. This is a soap opera. Because Warren Riding Hood went joyously home. And no one. <laughs> anything to harm her ever again. We'll get through this, but you need to trust me. I will dump you outside of the hospital so they can save your life if you tell me the truth. The truth? About what? I know! Warren. <sighs> I know that you killed Brody. <laughs> Dramatic music. Summer starts now on Hollyoaks. Please. Tell me he's going to be okay. I can't because I want you to watch the show. That trailer was almost four minutes long. <laughs> what was I thinking? Why? Why? Why did I watch that? Why? I, I guess there's a first for everything. I've done game trailers. I've done like uh, trailers for um, sporting events, for events, for concerts and festivals. I've done uh, trailer reactions for those. Um, so now a British soap opera. And I did look up the name Holyoaks on IMDb. And, uh, or Hollyoaks or Holyoaks. I don't know. I think it's Hollyoaks. And uh, it's been around since the 90s. This is like the 28th season or something. 27, 28th season. Uh, wow. That's a legacy right there. So there's a lot to unpack in that. Like, it's one of those things like, I think the trailer is meant to give you as much information as possible to hook you in if you have never, ever seen this show. And as somebody that's a in America, never ever heard of this show, have no idea about it. Um, 
I'm of the opinion that I'm not going to ever watch it and I'm not going to get hooked on it and I'm not going to watch the soap opera. Uh, the soap operas in the United States used to be on during the day when most people were working so it was just filler anyway so they would just have like the most ridiculous storylines ever. Um, like people died and came back to life often um, <laughs> with no explanation or very little explanation and um, people faked their deaths and different people played different that played the characters um, oh my god it's so silly like it's just it's the most silliest low bar entertainment that you could possibly have from television and I'm surprised that it still exists but Ah, to our friends across the pond, I don't mean you any disrespect if you're into this stuff. And I could see why you would probably try to battle over it. Um, but if you want to comment and below and start the war uh, for Holly hoax, please go ahead and do so. Um, I will probably be in the comments with you. All right, take care. Be sure to like and subscribe. Thank you.